someone. Today, I'm going to be giving you three tips on how to improve, on just how to nutmeg someone and what you should look for to get that right nutmeg that you want to see. Let's get into it. All right, guys. So the first thing you want to do is so you want to look for an open space in their legs. So, and some, some things, if they're, if they're just standing like this, right, they're just, their leg, the ball cannot come through. What you can do is you can use some moves to make their legs start spreading out. So what you can do is I like to do this a lot in games. So what I do is I take an outside touch and normally you like to follow the ball when you're a defender. So if you, if the ball goes outside, one foot is going to pivot to the outside. So if you go to the outside, their leg is going to go boom. And then that leaves you an open shot to go right through the meg. Okay, that's my first tip for you to get more megs. And let's get to the second one. All right, guys. So my second tip for you to get more megs is so let's say you, you're versing like an insane, insanely good defender. But the only way to get past them is through a meg because they're literally a mountain. They're super tall, super strong, super fit. But then their, their, their legs come apart a little bit. Here's a move or just a kind of idea that you can use to help that. So let's say he's in front of you, right? You do some moves to get down to the line. Now you're at the line, right? And you go and you, you start going quick. So again, so I'm going to repeat this because this is very important. You go and you dribble down the line once you get there, right? Then what you can do, there's two options that you can do that are more, most beneficial if you want to go through the meg. What you can do is literally do a back scoop and then one of the legs is going to open up and then you can hit it through with your left. Or the more simple thing you can do is really quickly go quick, stop, wait until, the, until their leg comes out and then go for the meg. What this will do is this will make it so that it's super easy for you to med them. And you'll just be able to kind of look for this more so. So then when you go through, it's an easy med. Now let's get to the third All right, right guys. So my final tip for you to get more megs is so this is more so a move as well. But this is very helpful. So body feints. Everyone probably knows them. If you don't, I made a video on it. So you can go check that out. But let's say we try to do an outside of the foot body thing, right? To the right. So we would set it up the same way like we always would. So we boom down, pretending we would go that way. Sh shoulder drops like you're going to run. But then their foot is most likely, if you're going like that, about to like looking like you're going to run, their number one kind of instinct is probably to move with you, move with the ball, right? So then they're gonna, their leg is probably going to be open. So then what you can do is you can do that body thing. Your foot's already in the right position to do this move. And this move, I really like to do. And you can you, you don't even need to use this for a meg. You can just use it to get past someone. But if you want to be fancy, <laughs> you can go for the meg. But basically, let's pretend their, their legs are right there. And they're, they're pretty much open. What you can do, bring this foot up and hit it through. Simple, because we don't want to go through the meg that way. Because they're, if they're facing there, it'll be an easy sprint. And then also, if they're there, they're gonna block us. They can easily block us, so we can't get past. And one of their, uh, one of their teammates could just snag the ball again. So what you wanna do is go the opposite direction still. So you go boom, and a quick motion, just like that. And then, so again, in fast motion, you go like boom, and then easy, easy and quick. That is all I have for you guys for today. Now let's get to the outro. Hope you guys loved this video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell so you get notified with my latest post. And I'll see you next time.